Okay, we go to uh, problem set number 2 ng algebra 2. Alright, so may mga na-double lang guys dito na, okay? Para meron kayong ano, um, uh, additional uh, reference. Okay, doon sa uh, algebra 1. Alright. Yan, siguro yung iba naliligo pa, yung iba nag-almosal pa. No. Okay, so, for, uh, proceed na tayo, guys, na. Okay, so, number one, uh, for uh, algebra number two, okay, using uh, remainder theorem, so, find the remainder when um, x raised to 6 minus x um, plus 1 is divided by x minus 2. Okay, so, remember na, okay, uh, na-discuss ko na to last time, so, pag uh, meron tayong p of x, sabi sa remainder theorem, Okay, when p of x is divided by x minus c. Okay. Yung pagkuha ng remainder is the same as, okay, evaluating uh, p of c. Okay. So, the remainder is equal to p of c. Okay. So, yung given uh, polynomial, so just let is let that as uh, p of x, ayan, equal to x raised to 6 minus x. Um, plus 1. And then our uh, divisor is x minus 2. So, you have two ways to find c. So, pwede mong uh, equate to 0 to. Then, solve for x. Okay. Ito na yung magiging c mo. Okay. Then, uh, lang. yan yung c na. Okay. Pwede rin uh, compare yung uh, um, uh, x minus c sa x minus 2. Okay. So, obviously, yung ating C dyan is uh, positive 2. Diba? Okay. So, therefore, the remainder, okay, when uh, P of X is divided by X minus 2, so, you just have to evaluate um, P of uh, 2. Okay? So, that is 2 raised to 6 minus 2 plus 1. Okay. 2 raised to 6 is uh, 64 minus 2. 62 plus 1, so 63. Okay? So, therefore, the remainder is uh, 63. And the answer is letter C. Mahada ba ang love, guys? No? Mahada ba ang light yung ano, sulat or mas okay yung, ano, yung dating kulay, eh, dating uh, pen. Ganito. P of X is divided by X minus C. Remainder is... Uh, P of C. P of X is X raised to 6 minus X plus 1. Um, okay lang naman ito guys na. Yung, ano, yung pencil type. <coughs> okay. <coughs> Okay, number two. Uh, sana dito, no? Walang magkamali, no? Sa mga gatong tanong. Which the following is a uh, uh, polynomial in X? Okay, so, isa-isay natin, guys, na. Okay, kailangan, guys, na pag, pag uh, polynomial, okay, must be written in the form. Okay, yung ating P of X must be equal to, nya, A sub N raised to X raised to um, x raised to n plus a sub a sub uh, um, n minus 1 okay x raised to n minus 1 plus a n sub 2 n minus 2 x raised to n minus 2 and so on and so forth okay yung dulo natin is a sub 1 x plus a sub uh, 0 okay so kailangan guys na yung mga um, yung mga exponent guys na dito, no, yung n to, ang kadito na, one yan na, there's a dyan. Okay? Lahat ng exponents kailangan guys, na, na, integers. Okay? Positive integers. Okay? Um, kaya na lang na to be specific siguro, um, non-negative. Okay? Non-negative integers. So, um, Ang iiwasan mo lang dyan is yung negative exponent at yung fractional 
exponent. Okay? Halimbawa, yung uh, letter A. Okay, yung x raised to negative 2. So, with this one, hindi na siya magiging uh, polynomial. Okay? So, yung option A, okay, hindi na yan. Na. Nakuha. Letter B naman, okay, meron tayong square root of x plus 3x, okay, plus 5. Okay? So, this part, yung square root of x, di ba, pwede mo siyang isulat as x raised to 1 half. So, meron kang uh, fractional exponent. So, ibig sabihin, Uh, this expression is not a e, uh, polynomial in x. Okay, so that means x. Uh, that that means uh, the expression in option B is not a e, polynomial in x. Now, okay, letter C. Okay, x cubed. Okay, plus 2x plus uh, 3. So, lot of exponents. No, um, ang um, positive integers. Okay, so good stuff. Ayan. Yung cube, yung 1 dito. Okay, so check to na. And sa option din naman, so meron tayong ano kasi dyan yung 4 over x. Okay, plus 3x plus 1. So this part, okay, uh, yan yung uh, um, um, tawag nito, nag-show na hindi siya polynomial in x. No? Kasi ito guys na, no? Yung 4 over x, pwede mo siyang i-write as 4 times x raised to negative 1. So, meron ka negative na exponent na. Okay, bawal yan. Para maging siya ay uh, isang polynomial in x. Okay? So, the option that is correct is letter C. Okay? Letter C. Yan. Okay, number 3. Okay, um Ayaw na. Sana yan dito. Sige, dito pala. Ah, kasi lumiit. Okay, number 3, which of the following or which of the terms in the expansion of y cube plus y raised to negative 1? Okay, raised 10 will involve Uh, y squared. Okay. So, this topic, guys, no, involved uh, the uh, binomial expansion. Okay. So, dito tayo na. Siguro, ibang kulay muna. Uh, gamit tayo ng, ano, uh, violet na. Okay. Red muna. Red. Red. Okay. Binomial expansion. Okay, so yung general form guys ng uh, binomial expansion is uh, a plus b okay, raised to n. Okay. Dapat ano, nasa labas yun. a plus b okay, raised to n. Okay. Well expanded guys, na yung kanyang uh, expanded form is ito na yung a raised to n um plus n times a raised to n minus 1 b plus um, n times n minus 1 over 2 a raised to n minus 2 and then b squared okay plus ang kasunod nito is n times n minus 1 n minus 2 over uh, 1 times 2 times 3 then Um, a raised to n minus 3, then b cube. Okay, ang dulo nito guys is um, n a raised to 1. Okay, then b raised to n minus 1. Okay, plus b raised to n. Okay? May mga ways case na para ma-expand yung, ano, yung expression na to. Yung a plus b raised to n. No? You can use the Uh, Pascal's triangle no, para sa pagkuha ng mga coefficients no, yung ito yung mga katabi dyan yung n n, n minus 1 over 2 n times n minus 1 n minus 2 uh, over 1 times 2 times 3 okay uh, sa Pascal's triangle diba okay yun na um, a plus b ibang kulay siguro naman ibang kulay um, dahil green na okay Ayan, a plus b raised to 0. Okay? A plus b raised to 1. Ano ba yan? 
uh, a plus b raised to 2 okay um, uh, a plus b raised to 3 okay a plus b pero ako guys nung ano nung college ako di ko di ko to ginagawa no okay kasi alam ko dito yung technique although ano lang syempre um i have to memorize na no, yung ano yung way okay i mean yung formula and then yung uh, uh, tamang notation no? a plus b raised to 5 so paano gawin to no? okay so yung guys na n number raised to 0 is Basta non-zero siya. Okay. Ang sagot dyan is 1. Okay. Ibang kulay naman. Uh, black tayo. Black. Okay. One yan. Okay. Tapos, pag A plus B raised to 1, ibig sabihin A plus B lang yan. Okay. Kukopyan mo lang guys yung copy siya ng A tsaka B. So, ito siya na 1 tsaka 1. Pag A plus B squared guys, di ba ano to? Um, A squared plus uh, 2AB plus b squared. So, yung mga coefficients ay 1, 2, and 1. Okay. So, ito yun na. 1, 1, 2, and 1. Yung a plus b cubed naman, that is a cubed plus 3a squared b plus 3ab squared plus b cubed. Okay. So, yung mga coefficients ay 1, 3, 3, and 1. Okay. So, ito yan. 1, 3, 3, and 1. Actually guys, no, kahit di mo memorize yung mga expansion, pag alam mo yung pag-create ng, ano, ng Pascal's triangle. Okay? So, ito yan guys, ha. Um, yun ito, ano. Ah, siguro makatay ng another pen. Para di, ano, nahihirapan yung isa doon. Ah, red, red. Okay, yun ito guys, ha. Ito, yung sum niya is 2. Okay? Okay. <coughs> Yung sum nito, 3. Ayan. 2 plus 1 is 3. Okay? So, guys, yung next dito, ito mo na makuha. Yung mga coefficients. Okay? Ayan. So, yung a plus b raised to 4, pag in mo yan, yung mga coefficients ay 1, okay, 4, 6, 4, and 1. Okay? Pag 5 naman, guys, so 1, 1 plus 4 is 5. 4 plus 6 is 10. 6 plus 4 is 10, 4 plus 1 is 5, and then 1. Okay? Ganun yung, ano, yung, ah, uh, uh, Pascal's, okay, <coughs> triangle. Ayan. So, gagawa ka ng table, or, ano, ano, ng triangle. Okay? Yung isang way pa dito, okay, sa pagkuha ng term. Ito kasi, guys, na, ah, uh, Sabay-sabi mo sila makuha. Okay? So, understood naman yan, guys, no? Yung coefficient, ay, yung exponent ng A, pababa yung exponent ng B, pataas na. Okay? Yan, no? N, N minus 1, N minus 2, hanggang kay 1 na lang to, then wala na, no? Okay? Tapos, si, si B naman, galing wala. Okay? Nag-1, nag-2, nag-3, N minus 1, hanggang kay N. Okay? May pattern naman yan, eh. Okay, then, pag yung a plus b guys no ni-raise mo kay n, okay lagi tayong merong ano diyan, um n plus 1 na uh, terms, okay? n plus 1 terms. So ibig sabihin guys, no kung yung n mo is um pag yung n mo is add, ano kaya ibig sabihin noon? Pag add siya, ibig sabihin ko n plus 1 'yan, 'di ba? Add plus 1 is even. So meron kang even terms. So ibig sabihin guys na no, pag yung add mo is n, wala tayong middle term. Okay? Ganun lang yun eh. And then, pag ang n mo is even, okay, so even plus 1 magiging add. Okay? So, yung number of terms is add. So, that means the expansion has a middle term. Okay? Yan lang. Yung, <coughs> yung uh, general formula for finding the n term is, so guys na, general uh, Uh, formula okay for uh, the nth hindi pala nth dapat ano pala art art term okay kung ano kung, ibig sabihin guys na yung <coughs> yung specific term pwede mo makuha so isa isa mo na lang na okay art term. Kasi, dito sa Pascal Triangle, so, sunod-sunod na yan. No? First, nabaka dito sa 
sa race to five. Okay, ito yung first, second, third, okay, fourth, fifth, and sixth. Okay, so meron kang six terms. Now, sa, sa our term, general formula. So, yung specific term lang yung kukunin mo. Ba, yung, uh, yung third term, ganyan. No? So, ito yung, spon- y- ito yung coefficient. No? Okay, pero guys, no, uh, hindi lahat ang oras yung problem is A plus B. Okay, sometimes, ano, yung A mo, pwede mo siyang x squared, x cubed, okay? So, ikaw yung, ano, yung uh, mag-aayos na lang nun. Okay, dito sa Pascal Triangle na. No? Okay, so, the, <coughs> the general formula is, okay, right tayo na. Okay, yung K term, ay, yung R term. Okay, wala ko lang ito, no? Kasi, sayo ng space. Yung ating R term. is equal to the combination of um n okay okay um uh, taken r minus 1 at a time okay and then uh yung a natin raised to n minus r plus 1 and then b raised to r minus 1 okay by the way guys na yung combination pag sinabi natin uh um, ito na lang siguro na. Pag sinabi natin NCR, that is uh, N factorial over um, R factorial o, times N minus R okay, factorial. Okay? Yan yung ibig sabihin niya na. <coughs> uh, pag sinabi N factorial, that is ano, N times N minus 1, N minus 2 hanggang kay 2 times 1. So, hambawa guys na, uh, pag sinabi yung 3 factorial, that is 3 times 2 times 1. Okay, pag 5 factorial naman, okay, that is 5 times times 4 times 3 times 2 times 1. Okay, this is 6. Uh, this is 120. Okay, by the way, 0 factorial, guys, is uh, 1. Okay. Ano yun, the permutation of, uh, of uh, 0 things, siyempre, 1 lang yan. <coughs> <coughs> okay uh, Ano yung ating problem? Okay Which of the terms involve y squared? Okay The problem is At the given is y cube plus y raised to negative 1 uh, Raised to 10 Okay So baba tayo kate. Okay So meron tayong uh, um, uh, y cube plus y raised to negative 1 Raised to 10 Okay. So, pag ginumpira mo siya, guys, doon sa um, ating uh, given na uh, ating general formula na A plus B okay, raised to N. Okay. Ibig sabihin niyan, yung ating A is Y cube. Okay. Yung ating B is Y raised to negative 1. And our N is 10. Okay. Compare-compare lang na. Ngayon, guys, ang hinahanap kasi yung Yung term daw na merong y squared. So, parang ganito yan. Parang merong kanyang coefficient. Tapos, yung kanyang variable na katabi is y squared. Okay? Ngayon, hindi mo alam kung anong term to. Ah, kung, kung siya ay first, second, third, fourth, and so on, so forth. So on, so forth. Okay? Take note guys na meron tayong 10 dyan. Ibig sabihin, meron tayong 11 terms. So, yung choices po lang doon is parang 1, 2. Parang 1, 2, 11. Okay? So, para mas ano, specific yung mga kuha mo dyan, gagamitin mo is yung R term. Okay? So, yung ating R term, again, okay, is <coughs> um, ano nga ta? Um, N, okay, C, R minus 1, okay, A, N minus R plus 1, then b raised to r minus 1 okay so ano yung ating n um 10 okay 10 c r minus 1 kaysa din natin alam yung ano yung r okay ayan ayan ang hinahanap natin na kung ano yung value ng r if r is 5 ibig sabihin the fifth term yun okay um yung a natin is y cube okay check ko lang doon baka ano y cube Okay, y cube. So, 
y cube raised to n natin is 10 minus r plus 1. Yung ating b guys is y raised to negative 1. So, y raised to negative 1. Raised to r minus 1. Okay? Ito guys, no, assist lang yan. No, sulat mo lang siya yan. 10 c r minus 1. Okay? Simplify natin. So, ito guys, no, apply mo yung uh, property ng logarithm na exponential expression yung a, a raised to m raised to n diba that is a raised to mn so just multiply the exponents na okay uh, ito um uh, this part is 10 10 plus 1 11 okay minus r so multiply mo siya ng 3 so 3 times 11 is uh, 33 okay then, 3 times negative r. So, minus 3r. Okay? Ito naman, gano'n din. So, negative 1 times r is negative r. Negative 1 times negative 1. So, plus 1. Okay? Same guys yung base. So, pwede mong i-add yung exponents na. Okay? Yung a raised to m times a raised to n. So, just add na m plus n. Okay? Aha. Uh -huh. So, 10 C R minus 1. Um, y raised to 33 minus 3 R. Okay, minus R plus, plus 1. Okay, simplify natin guys. No? Okay, 10 C R minus 1. Okay, 33 plus 1. So, meron tayong ups. Tala -tala. N minus R plus 1. 10 plus 1, 11 times 3. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Okay, so uh, 33 plus 1, so 34. Okay, 34. Then negative 3 minus R, so meron tayong 4R. Okay. So, kung baga guys, no, diba kanina, ito yung blanco natin, no? okay? Kung baga, yung blanco guys, ito na siya. Okay? So, ang gagawin mo lang dyan, since ang kailangan mo dyan is yung, um, anong term? Diba y squared? So, kailangan daw, meron siyang katabi na y squared. Yung y squared mo guys, no, ito na rin siya. Okay? So, you, you just have to equate this one to y squared. Okay? So, equating uh, this two, so y squared, um, a y raised to 34 minus 4r is equal to y squared. Okay, equality. So, ibig sabihin, pwede lang yan pag um, yung exponents ay parehas. No? So, yung 34 minus 4r is equal to 2. Okay? Malipat sa kabila. So, 34 magiging minus 2 magiging positive 4r. Okay? So, 32 equal to 4r. Then, divide both sides by Okay, so syempre R na yan. Then 32 over uh, uh, 4 is 8. So, since ang R natin is 8, therefore, yung term na merong y squared is 8 term. Okay, therefore, the answer is 8 term. Nakuha na. So, if you try to expand that one, the uh, term that has y squared is the 8 term. Ganun yun. Okay? 8 term is letter C. Letter C. <coughs> okay, mayroong uh, question. May mga tanong kayo? Wala po si. I'm sure uh, nadaanan niyo to no sa ano sa senior high. Yung mga uh, ganitong uh, uh, topic na. <coughs> okay, number uh, 4. Okay. 
Okay, if a, b, 2b minus a is an arithmetic progression, find the next term, okay? So, it is already stated that the given uh, terms are in arithmetic progression, okay? Diba guys, na pag sinabing uh, um, arithmetic progression, there is a um, uh, constant okay, difference, okay? Between successive okay, terms, okay? So, ibig sabihin, ang bawa yung uh, uh, 2b minus a. Ang bawa, dito sa uh, first two terms, the difference is, syempre, b minus a. Okay? And ito rin, na, ano difference dyan? Na? So, 2b minus a minus b. So, obviously, that is um, uh, b minus a. Okay? So, pag alam mo na yung common difference, how... Uh, you will find the next term. Okay, so, ito lang reference mo. So, to find the next term, add the common difference to the next term. Okay, so, 2b minus a na plus the common difference. Okay, which is b minus a. So, 2b minus a plus b minus a. Okay, combine like terms, no? So, 2b plus 2b is um, uh, 3b. Okay, 3b. Excuse me. Negative a minus a is negative 2a. So, 3b minus 2a. Okay? So, the next term is um, 3b minus 2a. Now, that is letter b. Okay? Ang pag mga ganito guys na probably, huwag ka nang gagamit ng n term na. Okay? Papahabaay mo lang eh. Okay, next, number 5. Okay, which of the following are similar radicals na? Okay? Um, masabi mo lang na yung, radica yung radicals ay similar if they have the same index and then the expression inside the radical sign is are the same. Okay? Halimbawa, um, yung uh, uh, radical... Numbers na ano, square root of 2, then 2 square root of 3. Okay? Ay, 2 square root of 2. No? Okay? Kasi, para silang mayroon square root of 2. So, ibig sabihin, pwede mong i-add yan. Okay? Diba? Kasi, pag in-add mo yung square root of 2 plus 2 square root of 2. So, understood guys na mayroon 1 yan. Okay? So, that is 3 square root of 2. Okay? Uh, ano pa ba? Bawa, uh, uh, 2 cube root of 2, and then, uh, uh, cube root of Let's say, 4 cube root of 2. Ganyan na. Ay, yung cube root of 2, yan yung ano. Um, nagkapakita na sila ay similar radicals. Okay? So, now, let's go to uh, uh, the options now. So, um, alin sa mga options natin ang uh, merong similar radical. So, you have to simplify each radical. No? Okay? Uh, one by one to. Okay, yan. Let, letter A. Um, we are times square root of the square root of 32 and then square root of 12. So we start with square root of 32. So think of a number or factors of 32. Now, yung isang number or isang factor i perfect square. Okay, so siempre again i uh, 2n 16. Okay, so 16 times 2. Okay, pag ganito guys, no understood uh, yung 16 that is 4 squared. Diba? So pwede mo siyang ilabas maging 4 square root of 2. Okay? Now, how about uh, 12? Okay, 12, ang kanyang factors ay na mayroong perfect square ay 4 and 3. So, 4 times 3. Okay, yung 4 ay 2 squared. So, that is 2 square root of 3. Okay? Since ang ating radicals ay square root of 2 at square root of 3, so, they are not the same. Okay? I mean, they are not similar pala. Okay? Magkaiba yung similar sa same. Okay? Pag sila may similar, may, may, ano, may, may, uh, uh, pagkakahawig. Na, not necessary of the same shape. Ganun yung similar, guys, na. Kasi pag same, uh, same yung size. Ganun. Okay? Same yung shape. Okay. Now, how about, uh, option B? Okay. Option B. Tayo. Okay. Cube root of 16. Cube root of 16. So, think of two numbers na yung isang factor, isang number ay merong ano, perfect cube. Okay? So, yung factor ng 16 ay 2 and 8. Okay? 
So, cube root ng Okay, 8 times 2. Then, yung 8, guys, that is 2 cube. Okay? So, pag sinimplify mo siya, syempre, kung meron siyang cube root, no? Yung 2 cube. Okay, 2 cube root of 2. Okay? Now, how about um, uh, cube root of 54? Cube root of 54. Okay, ano yung factors niya na merong uh, perfect cube? Okay, so that is uh, 27 and 2 guys. Okay, 27 and 2. Okay, cube root, 27 times 2. Yung 27 guys is 3 cube. Okay, so pwede may labas yung 3. Kaya 3 cube root of 2. Okay, so meron tayong um, cube root of 2 dito and then cube root of 2. So obviously guys, na similar na to. Yung sa option B. Okay. Kaya di mo na guys siguro ano, i-check yung si Chaka D. No? Okay. So, the answer here is uh, letter B. Pero, um, uh, uh, para malaman nyo na, okay, na um, uh, hindi similar yung, ano, yung C and D. So, try natin. Okay. C. Okay. Meron tayong fourth root of uh, 32. Okay. So, think of two numbers na yung sa ay merong perfect ah uh, ah ba tawag nun <laughs> yung ano meron siyang uh, perfect na fourth power okay um uh, ano ba 16 na okay so 16 16 times 2 okay fourth root okay yung 16 guys that is 2 raised to 4 kaya ang simpl simplified uh, form niya is 2 the fourth root of 2 Okay, now how about 48? 4th root of 48. So again, ang factors niya ay uh, 16 times 3. Okay, so ang simplified form is 2 cube root, ah mali, 4th root of 3. So yan, 4th root of 2, 4th root of 3, hindi parehas na, okay. And di naman, um, the pip root of 64. Okay? So, think of a number na merong uh, p power. So, that is 32. No? Kasi ang factors ng 64 ay 2 times 32. Okay? So, p root of 32 times 2. Okay? Since ang 32 mo ay 2 raised to 5, okay, ang simplified uh, form nito is 2 uh, the p root of And then, uh, C 96 naman guys, na pip root of 96, ah 69 naman. <laughs> Labalik na, bis na 96 naging 69. Okay, 96 is equal to pip root of, okay, ganun din na, 32 times 3. Okay, so, um, uh, 2 pip root of 3. Ayan. So, p root of 2, p root of 3. So, they're not similar. Okay? The answer is uh, letter B. Okay? Letter B. Similar radicals na because of the uh, cube root of 2 na on both um, radicals. Next, number 6. Okay. Find the sum to Find the sum to infinity of 3 negative 1, 3 negative 3, 3 raised, 3 raised to negative 5. Okay? So, meron tayong formula dyan, oh, sa sum to infinity or the uh, sum of infinite geometric progression. Okay? Um, okay, sum of uh, infinite Okay, geometric. Yan, progression. Okay, the general formula, guys, is um, uh, okay, the S to infinity is equal to the first term, okay, over 1 minus R. Okay, where? Guys, na meron anong condition para maging tayo, maging convergence na yung infinite geometric progression. Okay? Magamit mo lang itong formula if the absolute value of the common ratio is less than 1. Pero sa guys, ano, negative. 
Saka yung R. Basta yung absolute value niya is less than 1. Okay? Pag hindi niya ito na ano, satisfy, hindi siya mag-converge. No? Wala siya magiging sum. Okay? Ayan. So, di ba ano yan eh? Parang, uh, ganito na yung A plus uh, AR plus AR squared. No? Yan yung magiging sum mo dyan eh. AR squared. Okay? Plus AR cubed. Okay? Ayan. Out to infinity yan. Okay? So, ito yung expanded form uh, nitong A over 1 minus R. Okay? So, yung sum natin is um, uh, yung required sum is up to infinity is 3 raised to negative 1 plus 3 raised to negative 3 3 raised to negative 5 Okay, mayroon ng ano yan eh, pattern eh Siyempre, kasunod yan, negative 7 Okay? Up to infinity Na! So, yung first term guys is uh, ito yan yung ating A Okay? So, paano mo kukunin guys yung common ratio? So, just divide uh, the uh, successive term Okay? And now guys, no, sa, sa geometric sequence or progression, the common ratio is always equal to A, um, uh, um, uh, yung, yung nauna, let's say, uh, K over, yung, sumun, yung, ano, yung kanyang sinundan, okay? K minus 1. So, limbawa, um, ang ginamit mo is second term, okay? Second term natin is 3 raised to negative 3. Siyempre, gagamitin mo is first term, no? 3 raised to negative 1. Okay? Ayan na. So, negative 3 minus 1, guys, no? 3 minus 3 minus negative 1. So, that is 3 raised to negative 2. Okay? Uh, 3 negative 2 is 1 over 3 squared. So, that is 1 over 9. Okay? So, obviously, yung 1 over 9 is less than 1. So, that means the uh, uh, given sum will converge. So, just substitute the formula, therefore, uh, the sum to infinity of the given uh, geometric progression is, first term is 3 raised to negative 1 over 1 minus r, which is 1 over 9, okay? Uh, this is 1 third, okay? 1 minus 1 over 9 is 8 over 9, okay? Ano trick dito, guys, na? Ah, uh, pag binalikan niya yung ano niya, yung sa fractions, di ba? Uh, if a over b is divided by uh, c over d, that is the same as a over b, okay, multiplied by d over c, okay? So, yung a over b mo guys is yung 1 over 3. Tapos yung c over d mo is yung a over 9. So, this is the same as 1 over 3 multiplied by 9 over 8, okay? Yan. Cuts lang yan. So, meron kang nalang 3 dyan. So, the answer is 3 over 8. Okay? Iba naman guys, ito ginagawa is uh, 1 third over 8 over 9. Okay? So, gusto mo mawala yun ng dito, no? Okay? Uh, so, ba? No? Okay? So, minamultiply, no? Both numerator and denominator by 9 yan, over 9. Diba? Yan. 9 times 3 is 9 over 3 or uh, 3. 9 over 9, o oh, cancel. So, ang tira is 8. Pwede ganyan na. Okay? Para siyang tama. Wala ka dyan nilabag na batas na. <laughs> okay? So, 3 over 8 is letter uh, B. Letter B. Okay, next, number 7. Okay, solving uh, in inequalities. Okay, so, hindi na naman ito, no? Okay, so just perform um, algebraic operation. Okay, ang um, um, may twist lang dito, kung mayroon negative sign na mag um, uh, alter ng inequality symbol. Okay, 
Ayan. Okay, so forward values of x will uh, x plus 3 is less than 2 times the quantity 2x plus 1. Okay, so write natin. Okay, x plus 3 less than um, 2 times 2x plus 1. Okay, so first, uh, expand the right side now or distribute to, to 2x plus 1. So x plus 3 is less than Okay, 2 times 2, 2 times 2x is uh, 4x, then 2 times 1 is 2, okay? Then, transpose 4x to the um, uh, left side, okay? So, maging x minus 4x, okay? Less than. Then, yung 3 naman, uh, transpose sa, uh, transpose sa uh, uh, right side. So, 2 minus 3. Okay, so, syempre, x minus 4x is negative 3x. Okay? Then, 2 minus negative, 2 minus 3 is negative 1. Okay? So, since ang uh, required is what values of x, divide both sides by negative 3. Negative 3. Ayan. Okay, so, yun na nyo, ha? Pag nag-multiply ka o nag-divide ng negative number sa inequality, mag-alter. Okay? Mag-change yung ano. Um, inequality symbol. Okay? So, negative 3 over negative 3. So, x na lang yan. Okay? Magiging greater than. Okay? Negative 1 over um, uh, negative 3. So, positive 1 third. Nakuha. Okay? Kasi, ano eh, um, uh, if you try to multiply the, ano, um, uh, uh, expression, no, by, uh, or the inequality by negative sign. So, um, di ba guys na yung ano yung number line ito yun na yung dyan yung reason dyan na okay number line so zero yan syempre dito guys na yung ano yung positive ay yung ano yung uh, puntang negative infinity dito naman yung puntang uh, positive infinity okay nakawa so ang bawa na okay yung ah uh, ah uh, yung 3 tsaka 2. Okay? Pag ang usapan ay ay dito sa ano, sa sa positive side. Okay? Siyempre, mas malaki yung ano, okay, yung 3 sa 2. Okay? But, if you try to multiply both by negative 1, okay, maging negative 3 and then negative 2. So, sino yung nasa ano, sino yung nasa leftmost? Okay? Ang nasa leftmost is yung negative 3. Okay? Then, yung nasa rightmost is yung negative 2. So, pag nag-multiply ka guys ng negative sign, mag-change yung position. Okay? Kung baga, pag mayroon kang AB, okay, mag ano sila, mag-change position. Okay? Ano lang mo yan. Kaya, yung inequality symbol, kailangan magpalit din. Okay? Ayan. So, the required answer is X is greater than one-third. Now, which is, okay, letter B. Alright. Okay, next number eight. <coughs> if um x y is equal to twelve, x z is fifteen, and then y z is twenty, uh, find the value of x y z. Okay, yung product ng x saka y and z. So usually guys, to ang uh, gagawin yun dito. Okay, yung uh, um pag first time nyo ma encounter ng ganito, ang uh, gagawin yun yun dito is i-let yung uh, dalawang variable inters ng common variable. Halimbawa, yung y tsaka z naka inters of x. And then, substitute sa sa um, uh, third equation. Okay? Kasi meron tayong three equations eh. Three unknowns. So, ibig sabihin, pwede mo silang isolve by substitution. Okay? 
Okay, try, try natin na. No? Okay, yung sinabi ko. Okay? Sa x, y equal to uh, 12. So, that means ang ating y is uh, 12 over x. Okay? Then, doon naman sa x, a. Okay? Na 15. So, that means ang ating j is... Dapat yun tanong. Para hindi tayo makakompute sa 2. Uh, ang ating j is 15 over x. Okay? Meron tayong third equation na y j is equal to uh, 20. Okay? Yung ating y is 12 over x. Then yung ating yung ating um, uh, j is 15 over x. Okay? Equal to 20. Okay? Uh, 12 times 15 is 180. Ang trick lang dyan, guys, na pag wala kang calculator, okay, ang gamitin mo muna is yung 10 times 15, which is 150. Tapos, i-add mo yung 2 times 15 na, na 30. Kaya, meron kang 180. Okay? Ayan. Over x times x is x squared. No? Equal to uh, 20. Okay, then x squared natin. Okay, ano lang ito ng cross multiply or interchange position? 180 over 20. Okay, that is 9. So, yung ating x dito, um, uh, square root, actually na positive negative yan eh. Okay, positive negative 9. Okay. Ang kailangan guys sa choices, ang mga sagot is positive. Okay. So, uh, uh, choose. Okay, choose the... Uh, Uh, positive uh, uh, value. No? Anyway, this is a plus minus 3. Okay? Positive 3. Okay? So, if that is the case, ano yung y mo dito? Ang y mo is 12 over 3, which is uh, 4. And then, yung z mo naman is 15 over 3, which is okay, 5. Okay? So, therefore, okay, dito tayo, no? x, y, Uh, z is equal to 3 times ang y mo is 4, then 5. So, 3 times 4 times 5 is okay, 60. Okay? 60 is uh, letter A. Okay? Yung uh, uh, shortcut guys dito, pag itong problem, di ba, hinahanap ay x, y, z. Ang ganda yan. Okay? Multiply mo lahat ng left side and then lahat ng right side. So, ibig sabihin yung guys, okay, Kaya yes, ganito yan. Kung baga x, y, um, antay na, ibabang kulay na x, y, times, uh, uh, y, z, okay, multiplied by, uh, z, x, okay? Hindi, ako uh, isi sa akin. Times, uh, tama, z, x, or, x, z na, okay? z, x, okay? Ayan, multiplied. Equal to, ang ating xy is 12. Okay? Ang ating yz, ang ating yz is 20. And then, yung ating uh, um, zx is 15. 15. Okay? Ayan. So, x, y, y, c, z, x. So, eh, meron tayo dito x times x, eh. Okay. So, meron tayong x squared dyan. y times y, y squared. z times z, meron tayong z squared. Okay. Dito naman, guys, ang ano na to, uh, factoring, no? Saan ba, yung 12, um, uh, 3 times 4, okay? Tapos yung 20, meron kang 4 times 5. Tapos yung 15, meron kang 5 times 3. Okay. <coughs> Then, ito, i-group na lang natin to Magiging x, y, z squared. Okay? Ito naman, uh, di ba, ganun din na, meron kang 3 squared. Okay? Meron kang 4 squared. And then, 5 squared. Okay? So, same as 3 times 4 times 5 squared. So, yun na sa loob, guys, no? Yun na siya. Yung 3, 4, 5. So, ibig sabihin, x, y, z is equal to 3 times 4 times 5. Okay? So, di mo need kunin yung ano, values, values ng x, y, and z. Okay? So, 3 times 4 times 5 is 60, obviously, na. Okay? Letter A.
<clears throat> okay, next, number nine. Okay, ito naman, no? So, uh, uh, solving, um, uh, um, uh, uh, proportion, na, uh, okay? So, actually, this is, uh, um, uh, uh, ratios, na. Uh, solve for x in the equation. x plus 3 is to 10. x, uh, 3x minus 2 uh, plus 8. Plus 8. Plus ba talaga yan? Check mo na guys ah. Ang mali yung nasulat ko dito eh. Dapat ano ito guys, no? Hindi ito plus, ha? So, paano yan? Dapat ano yan? Divide yan. Uh, uh, pwede divide. Pwede rin yung ganito. Okay? So, dapat uh, ang given yan is uh, x plus 3 uh, is to 10 uh, equal to 3x minus 2 okay, is to uh, 8. Okay? Uh, anyway, no? So, uh, write that dito na. X plus 3 is to uh, 10 equal to 3x minus 2. Okay, is to 8. Okay, there are many ways na to solve this. Na pwede yung ganito guys. Gamitin nyo yung sa means at extremes. So, yung uh, uh, product ng uh, means. Okay, ito yun. Equal sa uh, product ng extremes. Okay. At tali guys, no, say, that is the same as cross multiplication. Kasi diba, pwede mo siyang i-rewrite as uh, fractions na no? yung x plus 3 okay, over 10 is equal to 3x minus 2 over 8. Ayan ah, yung means guys natin, yung means yung 10 times 3x minus 2. Ito yun, yung ating i-multiply. Tapa, tapos yung extremes, yung x plus 3 uh, multiplied by 8. Okay, ito yun. Nakuha niya. Okay. So, yung cross multiplication is the same as means saka extremes. Okay. So, magiging um, uh, x plus 3 times 8. So, 8 times x plus 3 is equal to uh, 10 times 3x minus 2. Okay. Um, distribute. So, 8x. 8 times 3 is 24. Okay. Uh, 10 times 3x is 30x. 10 times, ti 10 times uh, negative 2. So, negative 20. Okay? Lipat yung 30x sa uh, uh, left side, magiging minus na. So, minus 30x. Okay? Negative 20. Yung 24, lipat sa kabila. Okay? Magiging minus 24. Okay? <coughs> um... Okay, 8 minus 30 is negative 22. Okay, x. Then, negative 20 minus 24 is negative 44. Okay, divide both sides by negative 22. So, x natin is, okay, negative 44 over negative 22 is positive 2. Okay, so the solution in the given equation is uh, positive uh, 2. Okay. The answer is uh, letter B. Letter B. Okay, merong uh, question? Wala po, sir. Okay, number 10. Okay, simplify the given uh, radical radical expression. Okay. The square root of A times the square root of A times the square root of A. Okay, pag ganito guys, no, you will start at the innermost. Okay, so write natin. Square root of A. Okay. 
of a then square root of a okay so start ka dito sa may um square root of a muna okay itong pinaka loob no so write mo siya as um exponential ako ah so equal to okay square root of a square root of a yung square root of a that is a raised to one half okay so ito guys na understood merong one yan okay so parang merong one plus one half yan okay equal to square root of a square root of yan a raised to one plus one half okay so square root i mean ah one plus one half is three halves na okay a um square root of a raised to three halves okay then this part naman okay rewrite mo siya as ah exponential wa okay so that will be equal to okay square root of a okay a raised to three halves so yung square root magiging raised to one half okay then apply Uh, property of exponent so 3 halves times 1 half na okay or magiging ganito yan na square root of a okay um, a raised to 3 uh, halves multiplied by 1 half nakuha okay so ito muna no, yung multiplication okay a 3 uh, na over 2 times 2 so 4 then ito naman may 1 dyan So, understood, i-add lang ang mga exponents na. Okay? So, a uh, raised to 1 plus 3 over 4. 1 plus 3 over 4 is uh, 7 fourths na. Okay? So, the square root of a raised to 7 fourths. Okay? Then, finally, you know, write as um uh, exponential na okay so a raised to 7 over 4 okay raised to 1 half so just multiply the exponents now so 7 over 4 times 1 half okay so times 7 yung 1 7 pa rin then uh, 4 times 2 is 8 so the simplified form of the given Um, radical expression is a raised to 7 over 8, which is letter A. <coughs> letter A. Okay, next, number 11. Ayan. Okay, so transform the logarithmic equation. Okay, uh, for log x squared plus 9 log y squared equal to equal to uh, 12 log x and then log of y into its equivalent Cartesian form. So, ibig sabihin guys, no, kailangan mawala yung mga log-log dyan, yung mga logarithms. Okay? Okay, rewrite natin. Na. Uh, ano ito? Uh, for quantity log of x squared na plus 9. Okay, log of y squared equal to 12. Okay, log okay, x okay, then log of y. Okay? Um, para guys na uh, di ka mahirapan sa pagsulat ng mga log x sa log y na uh, let's say na yung ating uh, uh, log x i a okay, let na let uh, log x equal to a then log of y equal to b. Okay? Um, So, ito, okay, magiging uh, uh, 4a squared plus 9b squared equal to 
Okay, yung ating 12 log x, so 12a log y is b. Okay? Lipat sa kamila guys na yung 12ab magiging minus. Okay? Then, ilagay natin sa gitna. Na. Okay? So, 4a squared minus 12ab. Bakit nilagay ko sa gitna? Uh, may purpose yan. Okay? Kasi magiging ano ito eh. Uh, kung mapansin nyo, ano yan? Perfect square trinomial. Na. Diba guys, ano yung, yung ano yung 4i2 squared? So, magiging ano ito. Uh, that, that is the same as 2a squared. Yung 9b squared naman guys, that is the same as 3b squared. Okay? So, di ba guys, na para maging perfect square trinomial, kailangan yun sa gitna is twice the product no, ng 2a and 3b. Okay? So, dapat ano yun, minus 2 times 2a times 3b. Which is the same as negative 12ab. Di ba? Say 2 times 2, 4 times 3 is 12. Okay? Ayan, equal to 0. Tandaan guys na, pag meron tayong um, a plus or minus b okay, squared, that is the same as a squared. Okay, pag plus, plus, pag minus, minus, 2ab. Okay, plus b squared. Okay? So, ito, pag ginawa mo yung kanyang factor form, okay, that is 2a, um, 2a, Minus, okay, 3b. Okay, kasi minus tayo na. No? 3b squared equal to 0. Then, 2a minus 3b is equal to 0. Or, 2a is equal to 3b. Okay? So, ito yung ano niya, simplified form. Ngayon, ibabalik mo yung a tsaka b. Kung ano yung kanyang equivalent expression. Okay, diba yung ating a is uh, log of x. And then, yung b natin is log of y. Okay. Yung 2 guys, saka 3, ipapasok natin yan. By using this property. Diba guys, na meron tayong log pag meron tayong log of um, m to the uh, base a. Okay. Let's say raised to n. That is the same as n uh, log of m to the base a. Okay? Guys, ha, pwede ito reverse, ha? Kapunta doon. Okay? Para ma right to left, pwede yon. Kasi madalas, no, nakikita nyo lang kasi, from left to right, no? Yung exponent nilalabas. Pwede rin, yung exponent ipapasok. Okay? So, ibig sabihin, itong 2, pwede mong ilagay mo dito. Then, yung 3, pwede mong ilagay doon sa y. Nakuha. Okay? So, magiging log of x squared is equal to log of y cube. Nakuha. Okay, then, next na gamitin dito is equality of logarithms. Okay? So, the logarithms na log of log of m, okay, to the base a is equal to log of n to the base a. Now, if and only if, okay, yung m mo is equal to n. So, ibig sabihin niya x squared na must be equal to y cube, no? Okay? So, the simplified equation is x squared is equal to y cube. Or, pwede rin, uh, y cube is equal to x squared, no? Ayan. So, ano yung ano option yan? x squared y cube. Okay, so letter B. The answer is letter B. Okay. Nakuha. <coughs> okay, next, number 12. Number 12. If the first term and third term of a harmonic progression are 5 over 21 and 5 over 23 respectively. So, ito yung ating terms. Okay, meron tayong H1 is equal to, nakaharmonic ka, naka naka progression. Okay, so let's natin na, 5 over 21. And then, our third term, H3, is 
um, uh, 5 over 23. So, hinahanap guys is yung 6 term. So, H6. Okay? Diba guys, na pag sinabing harmonic progressions, pag kinuha mo yung reciprocal nito, okay, itong H1. So, yun yung maging first term sa arithmetic progression. Okay? Arithmetic progression. Yan. So, 1 over H1. So, ano yung reciprocal nito? Ng 5 over 21. So, obviously, that is 21 over 5. Okay? Then, yung ating third term sa, sa arithmetic progression is H sub 3 or 1 over H sub 3. Okay? Ayan. Um, that is 23 over 5. So, ibig sabihin guys, no, kailangan mong kunin yung uh, sixth term sa um, uh, arithmetic progression. Kasi, uh, yung sixth term sa harmonic, okay, pag nirasaprakal, siya, siya na rin yung sixth term sa arithmetic progression. Okay, so, that is 1 over h over 6 or yung ating h over 6 is 1 over a sub 6. Okay? Ayan. Ah. Ang given guys ay first term and third term. Okay? So, paano guys kunin din yung sixth term dito? Una yung kukunin dito is yung common difference. Okay? So, you have to use the uh, nth term formula. No. nth term uh, formula for um, uh, arithmetic progression. Okay, ano yung formula mo dito? Okay, a sub n is equal to the first term plus n minus 1 okay, uh, times the common difference. Okay, ang given is yung third term lang, ibig sabihin yung n mo is 3. Ayan, a sub 3. a sub 3 ah. Okay, so bali a sub 3 yan equal to a sub 1 Yung n mo is 3, so plus 3 minus 1. Okay, times the common difference. Nakuha. Okay, so a sub 3 natin is 23 over 5. Um, a sub 1 is 21 over 5. Okay, 3 minus 1 is 2 times d. Okay, lipat sa kabila yung 21 over 5, magiging 23 over 5 minus 21 over 5 equal to 2D. Okay. Um, uh, 23 minus 21, same yung ano guys ha, yung, yung denominator. So, similar fraction yan. So, just subtract the numerator, uh, numerators. Okay. 23 minus 21 is 2. So, meron tayong 2D is equal to um, uh, uh, 2 over 5. Okay. Divide mo both sides by 2. Okay, so, di ngayon natin the common difference. Uh, 2 fifths over 2 is 1 fifth. Okay? 1 fifth yan. Ayan. So, ngayon, pwede mo nang kunin yung 6 term. Okay, baba tayo. 6 term using the n term. So, syempre, that is a sub 6. Yung n mo is Ano guys ha? Yung n mo is 6. Ganun yun. Okay. Uh, a sub 1 plus uh, 6 minus 1 times the common difference na. Okay. Um, a sub 1 natin guys is ano nga yun? Sa arithmetic is 21 over 5. 21 over 5 plus 6 minus 1 is 6 minus 1 is uh, 5. Okay. 5 times uh, common difference is okay 5 syempre <laughs> 1 over 5 I mean okay guys na hindi ko gagalawin to ha yung uh, 5 times 1 over 5 no? para meron tayong similar fraction pala ano lang yan no? 21 plus 5 over 5 okay so 26 over 5 okay so ito yung 6 terms sa arithmetic progression so therefore the sixth term in the harmonic progression is okay, 1 over a sub 6. So that is ang kabaltaran niya. Okay, 1 over 26 um, over 5. So that is uh, 5 over 26. 26, okay. 5 over 26, yan, letter A. Letter A. Okay.
Okay, next number 13. Okay, if x is to y is to z is equal to 4 is to negative 3 is to 2, and 2x plus 4y minus 3z is 20, find the value of x. Okay, so ito guys na meron tayong 2 ways dito na, okay? Paghanapin mo yung x lang, okay? Pwede nga nito, so yung usual na method, um, z is equal to 4, is to 2. Okay, since ang kailangan mo is x, now you have to express y and z in terms of x. So, ganti yan. Okay? So, pag x, y pa-partner mo, bale, x is to y. So, ang ka-partner niya, guys, syempre is 4 is to negative 3. Nakuha niya. Yan na. x is to y equal to 4 is to negative 3. Okay, write mo siya as, ano, as fraction. So, x over y, okay, equal to 4 over negative 3. Okay, solve for y. Ah, uh, solve for, how much? For y, okay. So, y is equal to, ano, okay, negative 3 fourths times x. Ah, baka sabihin nyo, nang magic ako, ano. Kung hindi nyo kaya na diretso, pwede man, ano, isa-isa. Okay, cross multiply. So, negative 3x equal to yan, 4y. Okay, then divide mo both sides by 4. Okay? So, yung y mo dyan is negative 3x over 4. Okay? Nakawa na. Then, next naman is x sa z. Okay? x sa z. So, ito, syempre, ang kapartner niya ay 4 tsaka Nakuha. 4 tsaka 2. So, x is to z is equal to uh, 4 is to 2. Okay? Rewrite mo siya as fraction. 4 over 2. Uh, 4 over 2 is 2. Okay? So, cross multiply. So, x mo is equal to 2z. Okay? Divide mo ng 2. So, z natin is x over 2. Then, ito nga mo, yung uh, uh, expression for yz, ilalagay mo doon sa uh, another equation. Okay, diba meron tayong uh, 2x uh, plus uh, 4y minus 4y minus 3z is equal to 20. Okay, so just copy 2x plus, ano yung y natin? Negative 3x over 4. Okay, minus 3 times z natin is x over 2. Okay, equal to 20. Okay. Okay, copy yung 2x. Uh, 4 times negative 3 fourths, so cancel yung 4. Ang tira is 3x. Okay, ito naman. Uh, minus minus uh, 3x over 2. Okay. Equal to 20. Okay. 2x minus 3x is negative x. Okay. Parang ano yan eh. 2 minus 3 negative 1 minus 3 halves is negative 5 over 2. Okay. Negative 5 over 2. X equal to 20. Okay. Multiply both sides by. Okay. Para mawala yung negative 5 halves. So, syempre yung kanyang reciprocal na negative 2 over 5. Okay? So, siyempre, mawala na yung negative 5 halves dyan. X na lang yan. 20 times sa negative 2 pips. Okay? So, madali dyan. Ito muna, no? 20 over 5 is 4. Okay? 20 over 5 is 4 times negative 2 is negative 8. Ayan. Okay? So, the value of X is negative 8. Letter A. Okay. Yung isa pang trick dito guys, no, ganito na. Yung ginagawa ko. Okay. Pag may nakita kayo ang ganito, x is to y is to z. Okay. 
x is to y is to um, z. Okay. Pwede mo magiging isulat yung x, y, z in terms ng in terms ng tawag nito ng another variable let's say k. Okay. Kasi diba, pag, pag yung uh, naglagay ka ng ano, ratio, ibig sabihin na may na-cancel. Kung maaari guys na yung na-cancel, yung common kay x, y, z is k. Okay? So, since siya yung na-cancel, yung kanyang uh, part doon sa may ratio is, ito yun na, 4, negative 3, 2, 1 lang siya guys. So, ito yung trick dyan. Pag meron ditong k, ay 1 dyan. Tapos, partner-partner na to. Kunyari guys si x. Okay, paano mo sulat si x dito? Si x mo dyan. So, yung common factor na natanggal, then yung kanyang katapat na 4. So, x is 4k. Tapos, si y mo naman. Okay, so yung uh, factor niya, din yung katapat. So, negative 3k. Okay, tapos si z, yung factor niya, okay, times 2. So, 2k. Ayan. Then, yung x, y, z, ibabalik mo dun sa equation na 2x uh, plus 4y para masolve yung k, 3z equal to 20. Okay? Kasi guys, dito, wala kang fraction na gagamitin sa ganitong way. Na? So, 2 times um, ang x mo is 4k. Ayan. Yung uh, y mo is 3k. Minus 3 times ang z mo is 2k. Okay? Equal to 20. Okay, iba ba tayo na? Okay. 2 times 4 is 8k. Ito, negative 12k. Then, minus 6k is equal to 20. 8 minus 12 is negative 4. Okay. Minus 6 is negative 10. So, negative 10k equal to... Or, 10k. Kaya taan na to, ah. 10k uh, equal to 20. Over negative 10. So, k natin is 20 over negative 10 or negative 2. Okay. Then, balik ka kay x natin. Okay, na 4k. So, therefore, the value of x is 4 times uh, negative 2, which is also equal to negative 8. Okay? Oh, same lang na. Pero, mas pabilis to, guys. Okay? Letter A. Okay, so I think uh, this will be the last na Ito guys, saan lang to Simple uh, na uh, manipulation ng function. Okay, so if f of x is x plus 2 all over x minus 2 and g of y is y plus 2, so find the value of g of f plus 3. Okay, so ang required na value natin is yung g of f of 3. So guys, na pag composite function, unay mo lagi na sa loob. Ano yung sa loob natin? Ito. Okay? Yung uh, uh, f of 3. So, ibig sabihin, you have to find first the value of f of 3. Nakuha na. Okay, so, dito tayo na para sa f of 3. Okay, meron tayong f of x is equal to okay, x plus 2 over x minus 2. Okay? So, if you try to evaluate f of 3 or at x is equal to 3. Okay? So x is 3. So, 3 plus siguro, ano, kulay natin na. Kulay-kulay. Okay, 3. Ayan. So, 3. 3. Ako ha. Ayan. So, plus 2, then minus 2. So, 5 over 1. Equal to 5. So, yung g of f of 3. Okay, ito guys na. Okay, that is the same as g of what? Yung f of 3 mo is 5. Nakuha niya. Okay. So, yung g of f of 3 is the same as g of 5. Okay. Ngayon, ano yung ating g of y? Okay. Meron tayong g of y is equal to y plus 2. Okay. So, evaluated at y is equal to 5. Okay. g of ayan, plus 2. Ang ating y is 5. Ayan, 5 plus 2. Okay? Siyempre, p plus 2 is 7. Okay, therefore, ayan, g of, uh, f of 3 
is the same as g of 5 equal to 7. Okay? So, 7 is letter D. Ayan. Okay? So, ganun guys na mag-evaluate ng uh, uh, composite uh, function na. Okay? Lagi kang magsimula sa pinakaloob. Ayan. Merong uh, question. Wala po, sir. <laughs> Okay, so, um, uh, yan lang na. Okay, so, yung ibang items dyan, guys, ah, uh, makasama sa, ano, nyo, sa, uh, quiz, sa Thursday or uh, Friday na. Okay. Siguro, Friday na lang na, Friday. Kasi, <laughs> nasa school ako nun, eh, pag Friday. Ayan. <clears throat> Okay, so, wala tanong. Okay, let's call it a day. And uh, uh, thank you sa mga amatin na. Okay, you are now uh, dismissed. Thank you, Pusin. Thank, thank you, Pusin. Thank you, Pusin. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir.